<laughs> yeah, we've got the two biggest kids in the kitchen right now, so you're going to definitely need to excuse the mess that comes up. And the, the kids are baking. And we're calling all chocolate lovers this morning, of course. You heard the theme. And if you have a sweet tooth, then this indulgent recipe is just for you. Now it's our Clover Bliss chocolate slices. Yeah, you heard correctly. And they're made with just a few ingredients and will absolutely satisfy your chocolate craving in one instant. And here to show us how is myself and Jamie Lee Jumbo. Yay. Jamie, we got a, a big task on our hands. I right? know you have a sweet tooth. I do. It's I know you're a chocolate lover, so this no. is going to be next level for you. Are you oh, even ready to do this? I am, I am. I don't know what you're doing on your side. I was just told to handle a pastry. Yeah. And uh, I'm going to come to that. With. <laughs> That's what we trusted me with. Okay. So let me get on to it. Uh, yes. This is a puff pastry, I believe. I bought it in a roll like this, so it's already half the convenience for me because I don't really know how to actually make it myself yet. We, you we clearly weren't there. on the show last week when I failed miserably. The thing was rolling and the... Yeah. Well, you're making some dough. Oh, it was bad. It was bad. But anyway. <laughs> You, right. you get to redeem us this so, morning. So this is pretty cool. And what we're essentially doing, it's like a modern version of like a long panini or like a flat Gatsby, <laughs> <laughs> something along those lines. So what we're going to prepare is our two sides or our, our, our tops and bottoms. And I'm just going to kind of just make sure that I've got a nice straight rectangle that I'm working with before I actually get really involved here. So very simple. I take my roll, slice it down the middle. You're so technical. Like that. I yes, love that. Yes. I, I was going to be a doctor. Um, until my friends distracted me in school. Yeah. Really? No, yeah, true no, story. Shit, yeah. And then? I got distracted by God that you know, the youth and uh, I'm joking, man. Oh. <laughs> wow, I believed you there for a second. I was like, I could actually picture Dr. Raul Mornay coming in for duty. Give me the scalpel. Give me the... <laughs> All right, Not so really. my task is pretty much done. All I'm going to be doing now, right, is placing my puff pastry in one of these little uh, metal containers that I've got over here. What do they call the tray, Baking right? Tray. <laughs> Baking tray. <laughs> yeah. That's usually what they call them, Ralph. This is my first time, guys. And then, because it's puff pastry, it puffs. And naturally, we don't want to get too much of a puff here because it's going to turn into like this, like, phyllo type of style. So what we're going to do is take a fork and lightly just kind of just prick it along the top surface. What this is going to do is kind of just allow more air to come through okay. and not so like, bubble up and collect God. underneath the pastry, right? And then, just to kind to reduce that uh, puffiness even more because this stuff really just wants to rise up like a Monday Another morning. <laughs> <laughs> what we're going to do is place another bit of paper, that's uh, cooking paper over baking there, sheet, baking right? sheet uh, paper. <laughs> Let me turn it this way. And then, Jamie, this is the best trick of it all. Slightly smaller tray. You can get the same size you want, but I place this straight on top of it. Why? To then further reduce that okay. rise. And then it's simple 180 for safety, for 30 to 40 minutes in the oven, and then our pastry's done. And then I hand over to you. Yeah, then you have an, this nice little golden brown slices, yeah. and then this is where you, you get creative with the chocolate, okay? So what we're gonna do right now is we're gonna take two cups of oh, Clover Bliss. I had to have some of this this morning. It was I so saw, sweet. I saw so you good. were getting in there. Kick I was like, my day. <laughs> clearly the brother didn't have any cake for his birthday yesterday, so, so now you're putting it straight in the pot. Straight into the pot. That's so convenient. Where and do you like, want me to put it in? <laughs> I thought you'd like mix something up and I'm so used to people sauteing things first but I'm like there's no onions involved here so maybe not. It's the sauté for me though. <laughs> <laughs> so what we're gonna do right now because we want it to be nice and thick obviously yeah. stick into the slices we're gonna take some milk and some corn flour and we're gonna mix this together. So now we're like amping this this clover it's bliss getting, up proper right? It's getting chocolatey. It was a chocolate gooey. dairy dessert now it's just a we're bowl leveling up. of happiness. <laughs> right? So, so what, is, what, what did you mix the milk with? Corn flour. Corn flour, right. And that's obviously going to give it that thickening, almost like a creamy texture, make it more like uh, workable, right? For sure. And just think of this, you can use this topping on pancakes. Ooh. On, uh, what hey, we need to do this for our next mountain mission. Eh? Listen, I'm, giving us ideas. I'm just saying that I'm making the insides. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. I'm going to mix this together, get that nice and thick. Oh, it looks good. That already looks so good. I'll just take a spoon and... <laughs> just have a bowl of that. <laughs> so that is going... You're going to stir that in, okay. obviously, until it gets nice and thick or the way you want it. And then you're going to let it cool. So what you have right there, over there, I'm going to show you. TV and moment. You, uh, boom, I see, boom, boom, I see boom, you've boom. got like chocolate drops as well. Did you chuck that in too? But wait, there's more. What? So basically <laughs> this is going to transform into this. And just look at this. Just look at this oh, texture. Oh, man, yes, please. Right? 
then we're going to throw in chocolate chips. It's Just to be naughty because Just it is because we International can. Day of chocolate, chocolate and all things that make us happy. You're chucking chocolate into this mix. Oh. Chips. We're going to oh. fold that in. <laughs> and then obviously with your golden brown little slices, it's been cooled down already. We're going to place that in the middle and then put the pastry on top. Oh. And you're going to put it in the fridge. And then right over there is what it looks like. We're going to dust it off with some cocoa. And I just want to cut it for you. I just Please want to do, do. <laughs> Of course, while Jamie's doing that, you, you guys can get this recipe on expressoshow.com. It's a sandwich like no other people. I didn't get sandwiches like I've got peanut butter on my sandwiches. This is a chocolate slice from just, Absolute just, Heaven. Yeah. And uh, Jamie is yeah. cutting into all the yeah. goodness. Listen to that crunch. Listen to the crisp and the ooey gooeyness on the that. inside. Oh, Jamie Lee Domberg, you have cut. come through. There we go. Look at that. Look at that. Okay, Beautiful. cutting it more. Do you want a slice? Yes, please. How can I send it to that? Bring it on, bring it on, bring it on. <laughs> there we go. Cheers. No, it's fine. Oh. This is mine. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and what well oh, no, I'm proud good of us. We did a good job. Thank that you. It looks so much. good. You <laughs> Made with love by Clover.